So we're at square one. We had to park quite far back because I'm taking up four parking spots. I wouldn't like be able to take up just two, but if someone parks right beside me, which I know they will, I won't be able to get out. So that's why I take up four. So I have some uh, maneuver room. I mean, in all reality, I'd rather take up four parking spots than uh, hit someone else's car, right? So yeah, we're going to square one. My hair is super fluffy today. I don't really have too much I need to get. I want to get pajamas. I'm hoping to get like silk pajamas. They don't have to be silk, but just like that type of material, like the really thin flowy stuff that's not super tight. Fit check for the day, which is just a dress. Oh, my nips are popping out. It's kind of cold, my bad. But yeah, and then we'll walk around. I really want a pretzel. So I might go get a pretzel first. And then other than that, that's actually pretty much it. Feels really weird being, being back here. I know I've said that a lot, but yeah, it's just kind of weird. It's also a weird feeling potentially running into people that you know. I don't like it. <laughs> Lots of people here, man. Uh, super happy. I have a bunch of these like sports bras that I really love the material on. So I ended up finding the store. Oh my God, there's so many people looking at me. I ended up finding the store that sells them and they sell tank tops in the same material. So I got a couple of those and then a couple of hair clips because my hair is starting to get a little long, but we're gonna get a pretzel, then we're gonna eat it, and then we're gonna go upstairs and see what's up there. Part of me wants to walk around with a selfie stick because this is a horrible angle that I keep filming myself in. I feel like I'd look better from up here, but I'm not gonna walk around with my hands sticking out like an influencer. Those are pretty shoes. <gasps> those are really pretty shoes. I like those. I don't need shoes, but you know what? I haven't been to Call It Spring in a long, long, long time. And that's one of my favorite shoe spots. Also, I hope you guys can hear me. It's kind of loud. There's a bit of background noise, not too, too much. Um, I also should probably get some headphones and like a little microphone so you guys can hear me a little bit better. But we got our pretzel, just a salted one. We're near the food court. I don't know why, but the food court always scares me a little bit. I think it's just way too open of a space for my liking. But yeah, maybe we'll go to Call of Spring. Honestly, the shopping trip was already a success. Just getting some cheap tank tops. That's mainly what I came for. Although I don't have any pants to wear them with. I really want some type of like mom mom jeans like hippie style corduroy flare bottom you know that matches my hair and if you know if you've seen my hair you know exactly the type of jeans i'm talking about but jeans are expensive but we'll go walk around a little bit i have about half an hour before i'll probably go back to the doggy and the kitty so yeah and I gotta eat my pretzel. There was a lot going on in there. <laughs> we ended up getting some sushi. Some sushi. Right, puppy? Yeah. Aww. Yeah, we ended up getting some California rolls. Not really sushi, but white people's sushi? Get out of here. Um, then we also got a peach white tea with uh, tapioca pearls. 
Oh, and the dreaded cardboard straw. Because, you know, nothing saves the planet more like a cardboard straw that gets soggy in a full plastic cup. Smart. Very smart. Government of Canada, you know, smart. Yeah. Anyway. Oh, these are gonna fall apart. And it already did fall apart. Yeah. Just tastes like a California roll. What did we get? We got some clips, because they were a dollar. Do I have no scissors up here? I find that hard to believe. Oh, that worked. Got some clips, you know. Back of my head probably looks really messed up right now because I haven't had hair long enough to know how to properly style it. We also got some socks with froggies on it. Because frogs are my favorite animal. Tried to catch the cat. Got some rubber ducky socks. Then we got sports bra in a pretty blue because blue looks great on me. Then we got some tank tops in the same material as the sports bras and I love it because it's not see-through like I can't well I can see a little bit but not enough and they're good quality like they're cheap for the quality that they come in. Another blue one. And then I also got a black clip too. And then we got some stuff from Aritzia. We had to get some bell bottom TNA pants. Honestly, I wasn't going to get them because I don't like anything bell bottom, but then I tried them on and there's something about the way the hips go and then like skinny thighs, which my thighs aren't skinny, but I'm talking about like the pants, skinny thighs and then flare again. It just made my ass look really good. So yeah, we ended up buying them, but I needed pants anyway. I went in for pants. These ones, are like cargo pants. They look really big, don't they? Yo, yeah, they're pretty big. Um, they are a size 10. I have to tighten them fully on the side. They have like little adjustment straps and they need to be fully tightened to fit me. I'm normally, I think a size six or a size eight, but if you're watching this and you're a woman, you know that woman's clothing is all over the place. It's absolutely all over the place. So yeah, could be a size six somewhere, could be a size double zero somewhere else. It just, it doesn't make any sense. But anyway, those aren't crunchy at all. Why do they market them as crunchy, crunchy, spicy bits? Um, <coughs> went down my throat. Let's try this. Pretty good actually. Hi kitty. You want some? Look, you want some? You want some? Yeah, you do. Oops. Anyway, got two pairs of pants, 
some tank tops, which are great because it's something to wear under my sweaters. All of this sushi is completely stuck together. I'm really upset by that, to be honest. It seems like it was sitting there. I hope I don't get sick. It's pretty much it though. I wanted to get pajamas, but I started to get quite overwhelmed just with the amount of people. These almost look like tadpoles. <laughs> so we ended up leaving. But overall successful trip. I, oh yeah, so I ended up getting army green or whatever that green color is, green beige, whatever. I wanted black. But also everything black that I own, a lot of pet hair is very, very visible on it, which I don't like too much. But they didn't, I tried on a size six where it fit me, but it was, I like high-waisted stuff because they cover my, my baby pouch. I've never had a baby, but it's what I call the pouch on women. And yeah, that's why I like high-waisted pants. So I tried on a six. They fit me, but was kind of high in the crotch when I pulled them up to where I wanted them to sit. And so I tried an eight, which fit me kind of like, like almost perfectly, but still a little too tight in the crotch. And now getting older with not a lot of money, I start to kind of think for the future. Like, you know what, if I gain a little bit of weight, I want pants that are going to not just fit me right now, but also have some leeway to fit me in the future too, if I do gain a little bit. So the next size up they had in the black were the 12. And it was hilarious because I put them on and I was like, there should be a 10 available, but maybe whatever, it didn't exist or something. So I tried the 12 because it was just eight 12. Um, and I tried it on and it fit perfectly in the legs, fit perfectly in the crotch, but the waist was literally like this much too big. So even with a belt, all that scrunched up just wouldn't look nice. So yeah, I ended up asking for a 10. They didn't have any 10s in the black, so they told me to try those, and I did. And like I said, like, I feel like they wash me out a little bit, but at the same time, a lot of stuff that I wear is just, I like it because it's pretty, not necessarily like looks too good on me in terms of color wise. But yeah, I ended up getting the green. It might be fun to, to play around with, with different colors. And I needed pants, I needed them. They asked me if I wanted to order other ones, but they take like a couple of weeks to come in. And I was like, I don't really know if I wanna come back here to be completely honest. So yeah, I just told them, no, nah, I'll get the green ones. So hopefully it, it, I mean, they fit fine. It's just all about looks now is, is does this wash me out or is this gonna be kind of hard to style? But at the same day, at the same day, uh, at the same time, half of the stuff I wear is either loose fitting dresses like this one, which I love because it's so easy, or it is uh, like hoodies and then pants. And if I'm wearing those pants with a hoodie, it doesn't really matter kind of what color things are. It's not going to look that good. So, <laughs> but yeah, we are going to take off. We're going to go walk Novi and Kitty. Hi, Kitty. Kitty. Come here. Oh, I just shocked you. I'm sorry. Say hi. Kitty. Kitty. Are you ignoring me? I know you can hear me because your tail's wagging. Thank you. Aw. Aw, that's so sweet, baby. You're going to bite me. I don't trust you. <laughs> Never trust a kitten. Are you licking me? Your tail says otherwise. Your tail says you're pissed. You don't like sushi? Oh. 
Oh, I was like, what is he eating? But he's eating his foot. Okay, goodbye everyone. Some of you might ask me, Christina, how do you stay so damn skinny with all the food that you eat? Honestly, I'm pretty malnourished probably. Is it upside down for you? No. Yeah. We got some, 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 some donuts. I don't really like donuts. I just ravaged this box. <laughs> I didn't even care to open it properly. Um, but I do like the original glazed donuts. They're not warm, which really sucks. When they come, like when they make them fresh right out of the oven, they're so good. If you guys know what Krispy Kreme are. Oh my, what is going on with these boxes, man? I only got six because I normally get 12. And I eat them all. So sugary. Way better when they're fresh. I mean, they are fresh. They're made there today. Probably like an hour ago, but when they're really melty, they're so soft. Like, they're still really soft right now. But... Yeah. I got some splash back. Aren't you so cute? Uh oh. I told myself I was only going to have one. Sugar. 
so that was an absolute delightful, delightful surprise. I went to Le Vion Rose, it's an outlet though, and everything was like 50% off, but when you look at it, like I'll take this tag off here. If I can rip it with one hand. Ah! Okay, I'm just gonna rip the price off. So normally 44 on sale for 21. So I thought that that was the sale price, right? 50% off deal. No, no, no. It's 50% off the sale price. So I went in for pajamas. I got kind of a, a little bit of a warmer one. It's Christmas. I love Christmas stuff though. I don't really care if it's out of date. No one's seeing it. Like it's just for, for me sleeping in case I get woken up. So it was 10 bucks for a shirt and pants, which is to be honest, like really good. And then for what I really want to sleep in is something like kind of silk. I know this isn't silk. Let's read what it actually is. What's the fabric? Does it tell you the fabric? Probably on the inside. Do do do. Please hang on. Please hang on while I check the inside of the shirt. There's no tag to, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, 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 what is it? Some sort of polyester. Yeah, 90 per, 97% polyester. Apparently made in Canada. I doubt it. Um, but it's like this, like, you know, like this is the material I wanted, something really light. And so I ended up getting one of these shirts just for sleeping super big but that's because i love baggy stuff especially for sleeping but it's a nice shirt like even to wear it out and it had this tag 41.99 i figured that that was the sale price right no i got a white one too because the white one i can wear sleeping you know just as a backup it's good to kind of have another another one in case mine gets dirty but I also figured it's a really nice shirt. I could probably style it with some leggings or something and and uh, a cute little bra underneath. I don't even really own any bras, do I? Nah. Anyway, but I love it. Like, I love this type, I guess this type of polyester, the one that mimics like satin or silk. And this one was $29.99 apparently. I didn't even realize, but I thought those were the prices. Apparently everything in store, aside from these, because these were in like a $10 bin, which it said $10 and up. So me being me thought like, oh, the $21 or however much it said on the little thing that I showed you guys was that was and up, right? It fell under that category. Everything else apparently was 50%, oh my gosh, 50% off original plus price plus buy one get one 50 percent off so for the two blouses one of them was 21 dollars, so the 41 half off which is 20 dollars, and then the other one was half off as well and then half off again of that one so that one was 30 so that one <coughs> I'm too excited. That one ended up being $10. So I spent $40 in there. Well, 10, 20, 30, yeah, plus tax. So I ended up spending, flipping like 30, $40 in there. But yeah, I got exactly what I wanted today, which is absolutely fabulous. Uh, they had some really cute things though, like really cute things. I didn't try anything on. These are extra large, so I know for sure though. I mean, if you, I can just hold it up. I'm pretty sure that's gonna fit. Um, the other one is a medium, which I am a medium. Maybe I should have gotten a large, but I think it'll be okay. Anyway, today has been an absolute success between going to square one and getting the pretzel and then the <laughs> pretzels number one, obviously, and then the tank tops and the pants and then shit I got my pajamas too and I didn't even spend as much money as I was expecting and that's always a win always a win if you don't spend as much money as you're expecting to spend but yeah we'll hang these up 
because I'm not going to wash them before I wear them. I never do if I buy new clothes. I know some of like, that's a pretty shirt, man. Like, that's a pretty shirt. They have some really nice stuff. I wish I was rich, but if I was rich, I would need a house. <laughs> I would buy so much stuff. Like, this is so pretty. I'm excited to sleep now. Can't really hang up this, can I? Go long! What do they say? Go far! I don't know what they say when you're like gonna throw something. Sorry, I was loading. That's my day for you. Oh gosh. That's my day for you. I don't know what I'm going to do right now. Maybe go hang out. Probably tell other people about my deals that I got today. I'm excited. I got some nice stuff. And like I said, I didn't spend as much as I was expecting to spend. So anyway, we're going to go do some other stuff. And I guess I will see you guys later. Not too sure when. Kind of a weird, gonna be some weird videos for for the time that I'm that I'm in Mississauga. Just cause I don't have much going on. But today was good. Overall good day. So